Good morning, St. Nick's, and welcome to our assembly this week. Now, this assembly is all about um, what is special about St. Nick's for me. And I found it really hard to decide what was special. So I figured I would start my assembly by introducing you to somebody that is very special. Hey. Now, all of you, one of the things that I find so special about school is all of you. Because I'm amazed every day by the things that you are able to do and the things that you say and how creative and inspirational you are. And that is what made me want to become a teacher. And that is why I love being a teacher at this school. And you used to be at this school. And I used to be at this school. And I couldn't get all of you on screen, which I would have loved to have done, or be in the hall with all of you and tell you all how inspirational you are. So I picked one person, and the person that I picked is Dara. <laughs> now, Dara is in year three, and some of you may not have three met Dara. S. Yep, three S. Because Dara just started with us in September. Yeah. And Dara is um, very inspirational and very special, much like all of you. But Dara is um, for a slightly different reason as well. Dara, would you like to explain why I have brought you onto the video? <laughs> why are you here today? Uh, Dara, do you do something that's very special? Yeah. What do you do? I give bags to people who have diabetes and they're called Dara bags. And um, I put sweets in them like digestive biscuits and some finger wipes and finger prickers and some sugary stuff. Yeah, and why do you do that, Dara? Um, for other people that have diabetes in case they don't have enough money to afford anything else. Okay. And that's because you have diabetes. Mm -hmm. And so you find those things really helpful. Yeah. And so do you want to explain a little bit about what diabetes is? So some people might not really understand what we are talking about. I'm not really sure what it really is. But so it's all I'm about missing. levels in your body, isn't it? Yeah. Sugar levels. Yeah. And you have special medicine. Mm -hmm. and you have a special pump yeah. and Dara carries around a bag a lot of the time and in her bag yeah. is some special equipment so she has a special phone that and it tracks um, Dara's levels on her phone and she carries that around with her don't you Dara yeah it's, you... it's not the right way around but it's meant to say 15.5 hours sideways but it looks like 5.51 yep. in the camera. So Dara's exactly the same as you guys, but she just needs some of this equipment just to help her and keep her oh. things in her body where <laughs> no. they need to be. Yeah, there's also a phone like mine, but smaller in a teacher's one, but that's over in the classroom. by 3S yep. outside the classroom. And so how do you find enough money to do these Dara bags? Well, I hosted a Halloween party and I... Um, then all my school friends, my um, classmates came from St. John's and um, they helped me raise money um, to get the Dara bags. Yeah, so you do fundraising to raise yeah. money and then you give these Dara bags to children that have just been diagnosed with diabetes yeah. to help them. Yeah. And you had a really special letter from somebody as well, didn't you? Yeah. Who was that from? Um, Amy, but not Amy and she asked. <laughs> Um, but she gave me a little yeah. unicorn key ring as well. So she wanted to say thank you for her Dara yeah. bag, didn't she? And so she gave you a little key ring. And that Dara yeah. bag was really special to her, wasn't it? Yeah. And she really found that it helped her when she was diagnosed. So, um, and also, um, this um, diabetes mum that we know, um, she um, cut my hair. And um, um, they, we were talking, and um, her son... She said, um, do you want to get rid of your Dara? Do you want to get rid of your diabetes bag, which was the Dara bag? And he was like, no. No, I want to keep it because it's so special. Yeah. So we as a school um, need to think about how we could help you fundraise and so that you can make more Dara bags. Mm -hmm. And so if we could think of some fundraising ideas, we could create more Dara bags and help more children. Yeah. Okay. So if you can all start having a little think about what fundraising we might be able to do, that would be amazing. Mm -hmm. So Dara is here. Because all of you are so inspirational, and Dara is my example of your inspirational children in this school, and that's why I love it so much. But also, there's another reason why this school is so special to me, and that is because I came to this school. Now, Dara is rooting around in some things that I have found. So I went to my mum's house last night, and she has kept lots of things from when I was at school. And I came to this school, and so I thought I would just show you some of the things that she found. So Dara, are you going to show them for me? Yeah. This is a little... 
it is a little booklet and on the front so this is the old St Nick's where I first started and then and this is the new one. 1990. Yes it was built in this 1990. Is, it, this one is the school really right now. Yeah which is the school and now it has changed a little bit so there used to be a courtyard in the middle of this school. Yeah in the, in the library in and the there library. was like a little pond. Yeah there was a pond and a few other things have changed but it still looks roughly the same and this is a booklet. Yeah. And if you look in there, look, that's the oh. first picture of the logo that we still have today. But it's not the same as... No, yours is a nice Nick's coloured bad. now, isn't it? Yeah. Yes, yeah, so it's slightly different now, isn't it? Yeah. And um, what else have we got? We've got a booklet here, haven't we? Which yeah. talks about kind of the rules of the school and the things that you could do. And it's got a staff list of all the different people that were in the staff. And it tells you what time school starts. So it starts at 8.55. And it goes through till um, 11.55 and then 1.15 till 3.30. Where's the school, um, the school bags and PE and games? Clothing and games. Yep, so it tells you all of the things that you need to the know. Rules? Where's the rules? Rules, let's have a look. So there are some rules. There's health and safety rules. There's school curriculum. School. Um, swimming. Um, the rules for children to follow. So, oh, there's a, here, school rules. So you must behave in a sensible, controlled manner, respecting their teachers and other adults. That's, yeah. That's, that's kind of, and that's still what you do today. You yeah. have to control and be respectful. Now, also, um, my mum found some cuttings. Now, when I was at school and you did something amazing, you went in the New Weekly News. And so these are some pictures. Do you want to hold one up? Which one have you got? I've so got, this, this is, um... The that, head teacher. That's the head teacher. Mr. Sterry. Mr. In the Sterry. hall. So this is our hall. Yeah. And this is a play that we did in your school hall. Yeah. So that's in our hall, isn't it? This play yeah. that we did. And um, it was the play of Cinderella. Cinderella. And this one is a special cake that was presented to the school when they first built the building. And this one here is the building site where we um, came when this school was being built. And we put um, a little box of things under the school so that we could have a look at it afterwards. Yep, so this one is what we used to do when we were doing um, like art or DT. We used to do some um, sewing at times. And that's a cutout from the picture of the play. Yeah, and that's the cutout from the newspaper. Yep. And then what else have we got? Oh, we've got some certificates, haven't we? So, yeah. so I'll find some. There's some these are were our sports day certificates. Golfing. What's that one? Yep. Okay, yep, so it's super hockey. Yep. What's that? And this one was for swimming, I think. Oh no, this one was for a disco. So we did a sponsored disco in the this hall. This is the sw um, swimming. swimming. Yep, Wait, swimming what certificates. Was it about again? That's like a life saving swimming award. So all of the things that you guys still do. So you do swimming and you do sports days. I did all of those things when I was here too. And I remember running up and down the pitch that is just the same as the pitch you have now and doing my sports day and then getting one of these certificates. So one of the reasons that St Nick's is so special to me is that I have so many memories of being here. And when I come into school, I remember all of the things that I did and I love seeing what you are, guys are doing as well. Because now I am very much older and I still remember doing my sports days. So yeah. you will still remember when you're age doing your sports days and doing your plays and, and doing all of your lovely by, things. By um, how hold this to book because you think you're really old. Yeah, really old. Yeah, you um, think... So there are a few things that make school so special to me. The children, all of you, your everything. teachers. Yeah, all of your teachers. What's that for? Who make everything so... Um, such a lovely place to work with. So your teachers are very supportive and kind and they make working here such a lovely What's thing. That for? That's like a map adventure. Ah. And so there's so many reasons why this school is special to me. Yeah, that's <laughs> another one. Um... There's right, so we, many stuff. <laughs> shall we end on a prayer? Let's yeah. close our eyes. Um, thank you, God, for providing us with so many special things, so many memories, so many activities, and so many lovely things to look forward to. Thank you for giving us people so inspirational and people that can teach us and show us the way to do things. And thank you for giving us these opportunities. Amen. Amen. Now, if you do have any ideas for fundraising yeah. to help us, um, to raise money for Dara's bags, then please come and let me know and I can pass those ideas to yeah. Dara and we can come up with some great things, I think. Mm -hmm. It's a difficult time at the minute to do fundraising, yeah. but I am sure between you, all of you, you, you can come got, up with something. Yeah, you're, you, I think 
you go around all the time? Yeah, so I stand outside, don't I, at the back gate and the front yeah. gate, so you can always come and talk to me or I'm out in the playground or yeah. pass messages to your teachers and they can pass them to us. And then we yeah. can do something amazing. Yeah. Right. Thank you all. We will see you again mm -hmm. next week. Well, maybe not me.